The Faculty of Chemical Engineering of University Technology Malaysia use a range of student-centered learning techniques in their course. One of these is the jigsaw method. This was created in 1971 by Elliot Aronson in the primary school context. In a chemical engineering class, the facilitator begins by introducing the order of the day to his students. The students then divide up into their home groups to go over the previous week's problem. The idea is that each student will have a home group and an expert group to work with. Here, a problem is divided into four and each student from the home group will be assigned one-fourth of the problem. The students then split and form expert groups, each group dealing with the same part of the problem. In the expert groups, the students work together on problematic concepts in order to better understand their part of the problem. When the students are done, they return to the home group where each student will explain his share of the problem to the others, thus completing the problem between the four of them. UTM uses a floating facilitator system, meaning that he switches from group to group to help them with their problem. This type of facilitation is also used in PBL classes in some institutions in Singapore. When he sees that a group is coping well, the facilitator will move on to the next group. <laughs> 